thing of the week, thing of the week, it's your e-ink thing of the week, yeah! Hello there! The search for the perfect stylus continues, and today's episode we're going to focus on the Lamy All-Star. This is a pretty well-regarded stylus um, that's been uh, noted in the community for a number of years now, so uh, finally it makes it on to my review list. So let's go take a look at uh, the stylus itself and how it's going to score. Okay, so let's go ahead and take our look at the Lamy All-Star, and there's a couple of notable features to point out. The very first feature, and the most obvious, is the clip that comes on the cap of the Lamy All-Star, very much in tradition with the Lamy style um, with their uh, other pens, not just their EMR stylus. So they stay very much in brand with that. Also, um, there is the word uh, Lamy written here on the edge. Let's see if I can get that into focus. You can see that kind of on the edge of the shaft there. Um, and then on the cap, you can see on the top, there is this kind of star pattern right there. It's a little bit of an artistic touch there on the cap. The cap fits onto the end of the stylus. Uh, in terms of the stylus itself, uh, obviously it has this uh, pretty thick shaft, so it's thicker than most styli, even down here toward the tip where I tend to grab um, the stylus. And so um, that's a notable feature. I won't be scoring that feature, but for some folks that is an attribute that, that would be significant. You know, thicker um, pens or styluses are sometimes easier to grip. So that's something worth noting. And it's actually something I'm actually considering about adding to the scoring system, but I'm going to keep things as is for now. But certainly, if you're looking for a thicker stylus, um, this is definitely one of those you're going to want to look at. There is an eraser button. You can see that button right there. It's generally flush with the, um, the, the shaft around it. Um, it maybe has a slight rise in it. One of my criticisms of this, it is difficult to find both visually and tactily. Um, so it does take a bit of effort to actually find it, um, but it works quite well. So we'll just do a little demo like so. So definitely functional. Uh, my only criticism is that it's not easy to identify. And so that takes you a little bit out of the flow as you're going from writing to erasing than you'd normally like to see. But otherwise, um, quite good. And the nib, you know, I don't know if this will be captured on the microphone. But it has a standard sound to it. It's not particularly notable. Um, but of course, again, that's the nib. You could always replace it with other nibs that could potentially generate a different sound. Okay, that's an overview of the Lamy All-Star. Let's go ahead and score it then. All right, well, we'll start with cost. And um, I see this listed on Amazon around $47. So that's going to get itself a point. It has a button eraser. Again, it, it would get three points if it were easier to find. But I think having to search for that uh, docks it a few points. I'm going to give it a zero there. There is no end cap eraser, nor is there a magnet, uh, so it would be zeros there. But the fact that it has a, both a, um, a cap as well as this clip, that's definitely giving it three points in the special category. And then there aren't any additional points beyond that. So we'll go ahead and give them zeros. And then the total, therefore, is five points. So let's take a look at the leaderboard and see how this fits in. So with five points, that puts the Lamy All-Star right in the middle of the pack and surrounded by some fairly illustrious and well-regarded company. So a pretty good score. I think that reflects that here in this system quite nicely. Um, I would again emphasize that if you're someone looking for a thicker stylus, then this, uh, this particular one probably is going to be more of a better fit for you than even some of those that are ranked higher on the list. Uh, but I don't count that, so as it stands, it still gets a very respectable score. It's a great stylus no matter how you look at that. Okay, that's going to do it for today. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time.